Thank you. Sixty, and we are at championship point. Jockey Wilson wants double eighteen. Yes, the lad from Kirkcaldy. In five, Wilson. Sent to me last night. I'll show you how to predict, Jordy. I'll show you who's the champ. It's me. You should have picked me. He said. He becomes the first ever unified British professional champion. They'll be dancing in Kirkcaldy, especially in the Listers Bar. And I'm not not trying to be big here or that. I think I could compete with John and Eric. And I think I. My luck's just done, and I've got a wee bit of time on my hands. I could only get better. If I could get rid of that snatch, is what we were talking about the other night. I think I, I, I'm very happy, and I think I could be in the top four. That'll do me. The only snatch, uh, it was sort of the odd dart, actually, in, in, mainly in, uh, in shots when you'd thrown two that hadn't gone in the 60. Oh, Invariably, you yeah. were in the 60 today. Yeah, I was, I was scoring well, but double tens, I don't know, it deserted me during the match. But that starts, you hit some... You... Well, a remarkable victory to end a very good new championship, the British Professional Championship, and played, I'm delighted to see, in the greatest possible spirit. It was splendid to see. Well, we'll have more darts on BBC television over the next couple of months, the British Open, of course, and the British Gold Cup. And then the big one, wave on in January. Don't forget that, the full week's coverage of the World Professional Championships. We'll be back with that. And hope very much that you enjoy our coverage here from Stockton this week of this first ever British Professional Darts Championship. And let's take a look now at the man of the hour, if not the week. <laughs> Highlights of Monday on BBC Two. At ten past eight, the first programme in a new series of Des O'Connor Tonight, in which Des plays host to American comedian Gary Shandling, and from Britain, Lena Zavaroni, and zany comedian Jim Davidson. I'm angry. And at nine o'clock, a kick up the 80s. You better run and hide because you're phony and you're plastic. And when something makes me angry, I can really get sarcastic. I'll blow my nose in public if you say I'm cute and cuddly. Because I want to be rude, I've done a bath in the nude. A new series of Horizon begins at 9.30 with Heads I Win, Tails You Lose. The programme looks at the risks accepted in hang gliding, mining and driving a lorry compared to the risk of a nuclear power accident. Beginning at 10.20, a new chapter of the Innes Book of Records as Neil Innes, singer-songwriter extraordinaire, returns for the first eye-opening, heart-throbbing, knee-trembling programme of the series. Highlights for tomorrow in the new lineup of programmes on BBC Two. Tonight's film, which continues our Glenda Jackson season, is the controversial and idiosyncratic portrait by Ken Russell of the composer Peter Tchaikovsky. Richard Chamberlain joins Glenda Jackson for The Music Lovers. <laughs>